We're talking location, location, location today, and of course, uh, shining a spotlight on all the amazing neighborhoods we have all around the country. Now, located between Pretoria and Midrand, we find Centurion. Today, we have private property CEO Simon Bray joining us in studio to tell us more about this neighborhood. Is this neighborhood for the business type, or can you settle down with a family and call it home? If you are looking for that perfect neighborhood, simply head over to Private Property's website and find all the neighborhood information you might need. Simon, so good to have you in studio again. Good to see you, yeah. So when we think about Centurion, what kind of person will I find there? And is it, you know, is it a really great neighborhood? Yeah, Centurion is actually a fascinating story for me because when you think uh, the Gauteng property market, you really think of Johannesburg and some of the key areas in Johannesburg, and then you think of Pretoria. But Centurion is really emerging between the two as, as Gauteng's third city. So much growth, so much development happening there. Uh, and I mean, to your question about who lives there, a lot of first time buyers, a lot of uh, families moving into the area, uh, and it just offers so much. You know, you've got uh, great outdoor living opportunities. Mm. You're really close to work, whether you work in Johannesburg or in Pretoria, because you're along that main access yeah. of the highway there. So it makes a lot of sense. Car train, it plugs into Centurion as well. So it just, you know, from a commute time and from a lifestyle perspective, it makes a lot of sense to live in Centurion. But of course, we all want to know, what does the property market look like in Centurion? Yeah, as I said, it's a growth story in Centurion. A lot of new developments, and I think that's great as well. Uh, when someone's looking for a home, you get the choice of buying an established uh, house, one that's been there for, say, 20, 30 years, and perhaps you've got problems with the roof, perhaps you'll have problems with the plumbing. But what's really great about buying into new developments mm -hmm is you know exactly what you're getting. You've often gotten to choose the finishes, choose the paint color, uh, you've seen the house being erected so you know what the build and construction uh, finishes are like. So, you know, buying in a new development has a lot of perks and Centurion's been driven a lot by that. New complexes coming up, estates coming up, but still very affordable and I think that's what's driving the market in Centurion is just how easy it is to get into the market as a first time buyer when you're looking for that move from uh, your, your kind of bachelor days to, to your yeah. first family pad. Centurion is a great market to look at. Well it really is assuring to know. Now you did mention it a little bit earlier on when we talk about commuting because let's be honest there's a lot of that happening especially between Johannesburg and Pretoria. Is Centurion the perfect middle way? You know, Johannesburg is more and more about your commute time. Uh, you know, lots of people make the joke about traffic and sitting in traffic, but the reality is you can lose two, three hours of your day going between your business uh, and home. So you don't really want to get stuck in, in that. Uh, and Centurion offers a lot of options when it comes to commuting. If, you, if you're working in Pretoria or Johannesburg, you're pretty close to both of them. Yeah. You're right in the middle. Uh, that northern side of Joburg between uh, Joburg and Pretoria is just booming. And, and with that is coming new investment in roads. Mm -hmm. uh, the Gau train also makes a stop, as I said, in Centurion, yeah. so that's yeah. really convenient for people that may be near the station. Getting to the airport is a dream, so it really, it really is a good option when you're looking to try to unplug from that, uh, that traffic yeah. hustle. Lastly, is it better to rent or buy? Now, this is a good question, because if you just look at the statistics in Centurion, uh, you know, the property rentals are not that expensive so you can get a great home in a complex you've got the safety security you've got all that great access i was talking about and you're paying fifteen thousand rand a month which is which is excellent but um i would buy uh, i think the market is going to grow a lot it's in a boom phase now which means a lot of properties on the market there's a great amount of supply in centurion uh, but what's going to happen is as soon as that supply starts to mm -hmm. slow the prices are going to leap up so you could buy a great uh, two, three bedroom house in Centurion for around about two million rand yeah. and that's what I would be doing. And then we can't end without the Simon Bray tip of the day. <laughs> <laughs> Centurion is an excellent growth market, uh, probably one of the biggest growth markets in South Africa. So if you can get involved in the market, you should do it right now. Thank you so much, Simon, for joining us. Well, all you have to do is simply log on to www.privateproperty.co.za and let them guide you through the right neighborhood for you.